right? I just came out of Indiana and maybe a few miles. Well, I ain't even going to say a few miles because Google says I still got I still got some time on my clock. But right down the way, I will be hitting Ohio. Well, Google did say I was going to be home tonight. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. I wake up in the morning and I have a conversation with Google. I say, hey, Google. Doo-doo. What time am I going to make it home tonight? You going to make it home at about 7.30 p.m.? God damn, Google. Can I, can I make it home any earlier? Doo-doo. Your truck only goes 70 miles per hour. So, Google, if, if my truck was able to go faster, then what I would get home a little bit earlier? Doo-doo. Unless you want a ticket in a CMV. I suggest you do the speed limit. Just that, that's the conversation I be having with Google every morning. Like, unfortunately, I'm a guy and I'm, I'm, I wake up in places where showers and stuff like that is not available to me because of the way the way I be driving. I, I be trying to find some places to park and and parking in truck stops is 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 not the move at night. So when you running your clock like damn near out, you only have an available amount of time to find somewhere to park. Me, I found the I found the dirt lot off the highway. Went over there, parked, did my pre-trip, did my post-trip, got back in the truck, and that's it. But in the morning, I wake up, I do my pre-trip, I come in, I I bird bath, you know, I like that, get fresh, throw some um, throw some of that Jimmy Chow on because I like to smell good. And, and I have a conversation with Google. And then within that conversation with Google, I transfer some of the information into Garmin. Now Garmin, I can't talk to directly because Garmin don't, sometimes don't answer me back. Garmin just tells me where to go. It just gives me the direction. It says, go this way, go that way. But sometimes you can't take Garmin for, for advantage. Because sometimes Garmin be telling you to go this way, but you can't go that way. I really haven't had an issue with Garmin, like for real, for real. Ever since I had my Garmin, I never had an issue with it. And I, I never had an issue with Ram McNally until it blacked out on me. But the Garmin, I, I guess it's because I update it every, like every month. I take it home, connect it to the Wi-Fi. It updates. I, I don't have no problem. But when there is an issue, like if if Garmin says go down this route, and I just happen to look up and say no truck route, then what I do, I look at Garmin and I'll be like, hmm, well maybe there should be another way around. That's when I come back to Google and I talk to Google. I say, I say Google, pull up this map right quick. Doo-doo. Okay, map is pulled up for you. All right, I got it. Scroll around the area. I see where I'm going and I will see access to various routes that I could take to the place I'm going to. Now, what a lot of things that I have learned and a lot of people don't know is that some assets are available to trucks. You just have to make sure that you're making that delivery. So if you happen to go down that route and it says only accessible if you're delivering, then yes, you can go down that route, no problem, bam, bam, boom. But if you go down that route and you're not delivering and, and 5 pulls you over because there are some places where 5 just be posted up in the corner. They'll pull, they'll pull you over and be like, hey, uh, where are you going there, buddy? I'm going to such and such and such. And. Okay, well, are you going to make a delivery to one of these businesses that's on this street? Well, no, the, the business that I'm going to is like right around the corner uh, on top of a hill or something. No, 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 sir. If you're not delivering, then you shouldn't be on this route. You should be on the other route that takes you around the city or whatever the case. And yeah, you can get a ticket that way. So I, I have a conversation with, my, with Google every morning just to make sure that I'm on the right path. My Google has the girl voice, so I, I could talk to Google and be like, hey, Google, how you doing today? Doo-doo. Doing real good lockout. Yeah, I, I turn Garmin off. I don't let Garmin do that. Like when I'm traveling, 
speed limit is is 70 i probably might do a little bit over like 71 or 72. this motherfucker keep telling me like yo slow down bro <laughs> slow down slow down i need you to slow down look i'm only doing two miles over the speed limit what you talking about hey a uh, bro slow down what i'm gonna have to turn your ass off don't turn me off bro hey, don't taste me bro don't taste uh -huh. me yeah, it says that. It, it says, don't turn me off. Don't turn me off because you're going to need me. You're going to need me when you need me. I don't need you. You need people like me so you can point your fucking fingers. Then I'll be driving and then all of a sudden, all of a sudden my turn comes up and Garmin be like, fuck you. Uh, in too deep like Omar. Make me want to track you down and hit the track hawk with the crowbar. I knew we wouldn't go far, like we ran out of ethanol. Now your nosy ass mama want to get involved. When I met you, you was on the couch with the plastic. She need an Emmy. Bitch so dramatic. Now your baggage got me on edge like jagged. Fucking up my homes, look Patrick. You swift to jump shift like a chief. Been crying on my line like Therese. But it ain't all you, it's me. Blame it on the things I went through.